Tell you what, it's a big morning. Now, in the next, what, half an hour, 40 minutes, we're going to introduce you, to you all the people that have won the various categories in this year's Sun Sounds Rock Poll for 1984. And right now, for Best Female Vocalist and Best Australian Video for the video Power, Sharon O'Neill. Winner of two awards. Congratulations, love. Thank you very much. It has been a fairly quiet year for you, like, release-wise, hasn't it? Yes, I just had the, um, the one single out. Yeah. Power. And that one single wins you two awards. Pretty good. It's great. I'm rich. There were thousands and thousands of votes, and, like, you took it out percentage-wise. So you should, I guess, thank the people, yeah, eh? Yeah, for sure. Um, thanks to all the people that voted for Start and to Sounds, of course, and the Sun. And, and have the a sun. good Christmas. Yeah. Sun people, of course, started the idea and asked us to go with them. And now the people actually get involved, which is great. Yeah, so it's yeah. become a, a fairly major event, and we're pl proud of that. The readers who wrote in, we asked them to ask questions of the people that they voted for, right? And we just took three or four. So the first question from one of the people who wrote in was, as a female, how hard was it for you to break into the rock business? Uh, quite difficult a few years ago. Not so hard now. I think you just have to keep hanging in there and yeah. try to be as consistent as possible, I guess. But... Um, I suppose in the early days it was it was a trauma. Consistency now. Does that mean we'll only get one single next year? Oh, <laughs> no, we've got an album coming out um, in the winter, hopefully. Oh, beaut. Okay, when do you go back on the road is the next question from another. When the album's devoted. out. So it'll be winter, uh, probably a winter tour, late yeah. winter tour. End up in May, June, somewhere around yeah. there. Okay, when is your birthday was another question. Oh, 23rd of November. And the follow-up to that was, and how did you spend that birthday? Such a bad memory. No brain cells left. Um, I think I had it in Sydney and I just had a quiet dinner, something like that. Just a quiet night yeah, on the town. A bit of a rage, probably. Okay. Who did the video power? Uh, Stephen Hopkins well, from know. ECV. I guess we've got to thank Steve, too, eh? Yep, thanks Because Steve. Uh, he, with his work, uh, enabled you to pick up the best video this for this year, great. too. It's really Good on you, Stephen. Let's have a look at that video. Power, Sharon O'Neill, winner of two awards in this year's 1984 Australian Sun Sounds Rock Poll. We'll meet two more winners right after this. Stay in, Chaz. All right. Yeah, well, I'm in trouble now. No, I'm not. Here we go with the next two winners of the 1984 Sun Sounds Rock Poll. And it is only for Australian artists, as you know. The voters, in fact... Gave it to one and the same, Jimmy Barnes and the Jimmy Barnes Band for Best Australian Male Performer. Jimmy, congratulations. And Best Australian Newcomer Band. And that's a strange one, isn't it? But the Jimmy Barnes Band, of course, is new. Mal Eastick in to represent the band. Good on you, mate. Thanks very much. Good to see you. First time I think you've ever been on the show, isn't it? I think so. If not, it would have been a long, long time ago. Yeah. We've got to make this more regular. Congratulations yeah, on the awards. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you should come in all the time, mate. Yeah. Uh, do you want one? Yeah, thanks. No, so. I'll leave. <laughs> do you want it? Do you want to take yeah, it? They are heavy, but aren't they beautiful? Jeez. Absolutely. And they're uh, worth quite a deal, too, so you should be proud to get that. Do you want to uh, thank the people that wrote for you? Thank you very much. Thousands yeah. of them did. Yeah, that's on great. On behalf of all the boys in the band. I was shocked. <laughs> when, when, when did you find out? Just this morning? Uh, no, actually, I actually found out a couple of days ago. And people they told you that you must be here. Right. Please get down there. You know what? They, they tallied it all in Melbourne, right? Yeah. And then with the uh, people that wrote in, there is a prize for them too. And we thought until yesterday with the mail thing that we'd not be able to draw right. that major prize, but it got through, so we'll do that in a little while. I'll get you to help me if you can. Some yeah. questions from those that voted for you. Will your next album be recorded in Paris? Uh... There's, yeah, we're, we're thinking about it. We thought, well, if we're going to spend a lot of money, we might as well spend a lot of money somewhere in, like Paris, you know. Take a holiday. But, uh, it, it obviously depends on, you know, what, you know, what available at studios and all that sort of stuff. So, mm -hmm. I mean, you know, maybe Paris or okay. Rome. Now, Joe <laughs> Eli, the Texan, who was coming out, uh, what, yeah. this month he was originally? Uh, yeah, he was supposed to be this month. Yeah, when but, did uh, he get here? He's actually come in the end of January. The tour starts, I think, about the 2nd of February. Uh -huh. uh, he's great. There's one for Mel here. Mm. What's he like to work with? No, that's not. <laughs> <laughs> now, there's one, and I'll ask both of you. Your thoughts, this was from a reader. Your thoughts on the Deep Purple album, Perfect Strangers. I've only heard uh, two tracks on the radio, but I went to the concert last night, mm -hmm. and they were great. Yeah. They were killers. Mm. No? Yeah, I agree. I was a bit disappointed with a couple of things last night, but overall I thought they were great. Good. Mm. I wish we could get them in, but uh, they're having problems. They're doing a clip, actually. Had a and will you do a gospel album? Ah, that's a strange question. Yeah, I never thought of it. Um, it's like a rumour that I've heard of. I'd like to do a gospel album. It's just a matter of uh, picking the material and, you know, I don't know, you know, I wouldn't know how to start one, really, but I'd like to try one, yeah. Hmm. 
Okay. There's some great songs and some of the best singers have done it. You know, so. Yeah, sure. Great. So you should do one. And there are some of the answers oh, maybe that you people <laughs> actually wrote in. Let's have a look at Promise Me Your Call from Body Swerve, the album by Jimmy Barnes and the Jimmy Barnes Band who picked up Best Male Performer and Best Australian Newcomer Band in the 1984 Sun Sounds Rock Pole. Let's go. Jimmy and the boys, as we used to know, but Jimmy Barnes and his new Jimmy Barnes band. Great song. Now, two more awards to announce. Unfortunately, the people who win them can't be here today. But the questions that were written in and asked by you, the voters, we're going to ask Jimmy and Mel and Sharon, see how they go. These two awards are for Best Australian Band and Best Australian Album. And the winners were In Excess for the Album Swing. There are the two awards. And on behalf of In Excess, I will say thank you very much to all those people out there. Now, some of the questions that people... When will they next tour Australia, Jimmy? Uh, it depends, I think. Uh, I'll have to <laughs> ring up Michael. <laughs> OK, we'll ring Michael on that one. Uh, would you work? Would In Excess work with Duran Duran? What are you uh, ringing, Mel? Not sure. I think I'll have to ring Michael. Ring... <laughs> Sharon, help me. <laughs> Quick, answer a question. What is the true meaning behind the song Original Sin? Come on, I can't say that. You're going to ring Michael? I have to ring Michael. <laughs> okay, right. No, 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 Michael right. rang her about it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what we'll do now is draw, congratulations again in excess, draw the winner from all you people that wrote in and voted for the $3,000 stereo and deluxe cabinet made by the fabulous Nord Mende Peabody. Now, will you take the, uh, on the entry out, though? It's not an envelope, an entry, please, yes. As deep as you can, Bubby, with thousands and thousands. And there was a mail strike, so I guess a lot of people a bit disappointed they didn't all get in. We've done our best. Okay. Okay. Can you read it, Jimmy? David Garozzo of 5117 Rickard Road, Bankstone. Good bloke. Hey, you voted hey? for me as well. He's a right. Westie. Hey. <laughs> he voted for you. Yeah, he's okay. He a little rip. Uh, David, was it? David Garoso. Okay, David Garoso, you've got the Nord Mende stereo with a deluxe cabinet worth three thousand dollars. Good on you. To everyone that sent their entries in for the Sun Sounds Rock Pole '84, thank you and congratulations to all the winners. And let's have a look at one from In Excess. Burn for you. And we wrap up the show in just a little while, but there's another biggie next week, the Christmas show. Thank you, everyone. Okay, we got to go. It's been a busy one today, but we've got through a lot of nice things and met a lot of nice people. Next week, we'll do the same Christmas show. Over 20 well-known Australian artists coming in just to share in the Christmas festive season celebration. So join us next Saturday for our last show for 84 and our Christmas show. We'll see you.